Hey guys and welcome to the Exotic Armors playlist. In this playlist I will go over each and every individual exotic piece for each player class and discuss how to get it, what it does, and how to incorporate it into a build. Before we go any further, please hit that like and subscribe button and ring that notification bell so that you don't miss out on future content. This is El Jefe Gaming, let's begin. Today we are going to be discussing a pair of gloves for your Warlock that I personally really really wanted when I first found out about them and spent so much time working Legendary Lost Sectors to get these to drop, mainly because it's the only way to get them to drop, but just because when it comes to PvE content, they are so so good. These gloves are of course the Necrotic Grips. Like I said before, the Necrotic Grips are only found in Legendary Lost Sectors, so they do take a little bit of work to be able to acquire them. But once you do, and you put them on, most times you won't ever want to take them off. This is a very, very good pair of gloves for most Void builds, especially now with Void 3.0 coming out with that pocket singularity because it'll tie to your melee ability. And so with the intrinsic trait, being to where you do poison damage to enemies with your melee you can either do it up close or you know it now gives it distance with that pocket singularity but what really makes this you know exotic really shine is the second part of the intrinsic trait which when an infected enemy dies the infection will spread and that is very very helpful when it comes to ag control because you know doing poison damage without even touching them will already lower their health which means less rounds have to go into that enemy to defeat them which means better ag control and the grasp of the devour intrinsic trait which is what this intrinsic trait is called is just is very very good for pve um, I have tried this out in PvP just to see what kind of happens. Um, doesn't really do a whole lot, mainly because of how fast the PvP you know game flow is. But it is really good for getting those postmortem uh, kills, which, in my opinion, is pretty funny. Um, you know, you hit the enemy. You get their shield broke, get them down to low health, hit them with that melee, but you don't quite kill them, but they get you, and then you watch them run away, and they fall over dead because of poison damage. I think it's pretty fun. Um, but this goes very, very well with the Void 3.0 having a high strength stat, you know, so you have that powered melee ability, and you can get that really quick with that high strength stat as also with running wells which i do have another video with this um exotic which is the build that i personally use the majority of the time so if you want to check that out to get that build it's it's out there um but yeah this these pair of gloves are so fun to use really good for ad control i use it in end game content which most people are like, why do you use the melee ability in in-game content? Your melee ability don't do anything. The way you run it with necrotic grips, yes it does, I promise you. But that's all for today's video. If you guys liked what you saw and want to see more, please hit that like and subscribe button. This has been El Jefe Gaming, and I'll see you next time.